My name is Mel Segreta Wakoyup, and I was born in uh, Chicago, Illinois. So my first show, acting, well, it really wasn't, I guess you can call it an acting show, but it was an opera, Albert Herring, uh, by Benjamin Britten. I played a, a priest, a vicar. This is my second time that the, uh, King and I being my second time, I was here this past summer. I had the uh, honor of, of uh, doing Miss Saigon, uh, originally starting off with the role of Tui, and then um, eventually uh, there was a change in cast and they uh, eventually made me the engineer. So um, this is my second show, Walnut, the third role. Sleep? <laughs> really? I do. It takes a lot. I do like, I mean, I, I assume we all like to sleep, but I, I end up sleeping a lot. But besides that, um, workout, I love to run. I actually like to run. I've, I've been running for a really long time. Uh, I'm back in New York City. I'm actually a volunteer police officer with NYPD. I know that's a what? <laughs> You're a what? <laughs> you know, um, and I've been doing that for about six years, and I, um, um, I'm a sergeant now at this point, uh, at this rank, so, but obviously I haven't been able to patrol because I'm here. Um, long story short, um, my girlfriend at the time had mentioned she'd wanted a pillow that looked like sushi when we, when we first got together. There wasn't one out there, so um, I ended up um, making one and at the same time presented the idea of, you know, you know we're, we're both on tour, because she was also on tour with me with Miss Saigon, we're both on tour. What if, you know, here's your Christmas present, what do, <laughs> why don't you work for me? No, that's, that's what it sounds like I said, no. But what do you think about starting a business? I found that the king is actually in many ways very much like me as a person and in my, my own journey. You know, not, not that I have slaves and concubines everywhere. <laughs> that's, not the, that's not what I'm saying. But in terms of, of as a man and as, as his journey of, 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 from immaturity to maturity, um, of, having, of being strong-willed and having a, another strong-willed uh, person or woman, you know, lead him and guide him in his way. Um, so that's one portion that I found out. But I also found out that he was very, he's very much like a, because I've done both roles, engineer and toy in the Saigon, I found elements of engineer and toy from the Saigon also being useful in this role. I remember the first days of rehearsal when they were all there and we're like, oh man, so, did I really have this many kids? Um, are there that many cast? Um, they've been great. They've been so focused. You know, um, Jean, Brielle, and everyone else have, has been uh, doing a great job with with keeping them focused and make sure they're doing their job. Um, and in between scenes, you know, they're always giving them some great projects. The kids are very res are respectful to the best of their abilities as kids. But I mean, it's great to see them make acting choices on stage and to see them grow as actors. And um, I guess the biggest advice for me is like um, not to give up on the dream, so to speak, and 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 realize that you will have to make sacrifices and you'll also have to push yourself, you know. Um, and another thing too is being able to, uh, to look in the mirror and be like, okay, this is what I'm good for right now and this is what I'm not good for. You know, to, to give yourself a realistic shot by being realistic to yourself. By the uh, Schoolyville, Schoolyville, I keep, I saw you saw that thing I typed up. I can't, Schoolyville, Schooly, Skull Candy River. Yeah. Well, here's my advertising bit. <clears throat> um, whoa, let's drop my coffee. Sorry. Wawa, the place for coffee. <laughs>